Yeah. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Y'all let's hear one more time for Faith Temple Praise. Hey God, you hear the praise of the Lord tonight, alright? Yeah. Anybody know why? Yeah. When praises go up, yeah. let it go down. All blessings from folks. We're getting ready now to uh, bring in our celebrant. So I want everybody to get excited. All right, all right. You know how to get excited, right? All right. We want your excitement and enthusiasm to be able to get ready to bring her in. And uh, everybody here knows that I don't have to introduce to nobody. I think I'm just going to present her tonight. And she is a minister, she's a motivational speaker, a success coach, and I'll tell you some more about her later on. But tonight is her night. We are here to appreciate her as well as celebrate her birthday. A few years ago, we did Lordy Lordy, look who thinks she's falling. I don't know what this one is, but all I know is we're here to celebrate. Is that right? All right, so now when I bring in, y'all got to come on, come on, come on. Y'all got to bring her in right, okay? All right, so ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I present to you the Reverend Dr. Pamela Robinson Powell. <laughs> Thank you. 
She's, uh, she has a beautiful ministry and she's a people person and she does a lot of different things in the community with a lot of people. And I don't know where that comes from, but I think the Avatar falls off on the tree. So Pam and all of her sisters are dedicated in service to the community and their fellow men. So right now we're going to ask Jacqueline Robinson Taylor to come and lead us in our scripture reading. Thank you. Thank you. 
thirty one. And it reads, Who can find a verse of woman? For her price is far above the The heart of her husband does faithful trust of her, so that he shall have the good. She was a good man and not evil all the days of her life. She seeketh wool and flax and working willingly with her hands. She is like the merchant ship. She bringeth her food from afar. She rides also while it is yet night and giveth meat to her household and a portion to her neighbors. She considers the field and buyeth it. And the fruit of her hands, she planted a vineyard. She girded her loins with strength and strengthened her arms. She perceived that her merchandise is good. Her candle goes not out by night. She lays her hands to the spindle, and her hands hold to the rock. She spreads out her hands to the poor, and she reaches out for her hands to the she is not afraid of the snow for her household, for all her household are sold with sorrow. She raises her son puppies of happiness, her home is with silk and is purple. Her husband is known in the gate when he sitteth among the elders of the man. She maketh fine linen and stuff, and delivers verses unto her merchants. Strength and honor are her clothes. I'm going to say that again. Strength and honor are her clothes. And she shall rejoice in time to come. She opens her mouth with wisdom. And her tongue is the law of kindness. She looketh well to the ways of her household. And eateth not the bread of idleness. Her children rise up, that's him, and call her blessed. Her husband also, that's him. She shall be praised. Favor is deceitful and in vain, but a woman that fears the Lord shall be praised. So give her of the fruit of her hands, and let her own words praise her in the gate. I have praised you of this 31. <coughs> 10 and 31. And the Lord has blessed me in the years and the years and the years of the church of our home. Thank you. 